What's up, you guys? So today is February 13th. What is that baby noise? I don't know. <laughs> today is February 13th, and Dar and I are going to celebrate Valentine's Day today because tomorrow we are heading to El Paso to celebrate Valentine's with Leslie and Alex. Since Dar constantly surprises me, I decided that this year I'm gonna surprise him. So we are on our way, well, or we are about to be on our way. Um, Dar has a speaking engagement with YouTube. So while we're out, um, I hired a decorator to come decorate our place. So she's gonna decorate our place, and then later on, um, a chef is gonna come and cook for us, and we're gonna have a romantic night in. Um, so after his speaking engagement, we're gonna head to the office so he will have no idea. I'll head here and make sure everything is set. So yeah, he thinks we're gonna be vlogging today about his speaking engagement, um, but this is just to distract him. <laughs> All right. What's up you guys, it's Dar. And I'm Laura. And we're back again with another video. If you're new to our channel, then please, please hit that subscribe button. And turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video of ours. So what is the video today? So today, Dar, oops, sorry, I just hit you. <laughs> we're at the YouTube um, headquarters in Los Angeles because Dun, da, da, da. <laughs> Dar is speaking today, you guys. How yeah. cool is that? Are you I nervous? No Are you idea. excited? What am I going to say? I don't know if anyone's actually going to even listen to me. I might get booed off stage, so pray for me, you guys. You're gonna be <laughs> Who the heck is calling you? Just kidding. I think it's YouTube. So we're gonna go ahead. And, yeah, but YouTube can't get mad because we are putting content out on YouTube right True. now. <laughs> YouTuber, number one, every YouTuber goes through highs and lows. So if you're going through a low, don't feel like you're all alone. Literally, this is like every single person, even the top YouTubers. Comment, obviously, that also leads to like mental stress and whatnot too. It can be so easy to become obsessed that you forget to do just good mindful things such as exercising, reading, practicing meditation, spending time with family and friends. External success always starts with internal success. And then don't be afraid to take a break. And I'm sorry, YouTube, for even suggesting this. Uh, but, you know, it's a natural thing. Like, if possible, you know, the best, obviously, if you, if you don't have to ever take a break and you're not dealing with any of these issues that I'm talking about, amazing. Give me some advice. <laughs> but I took a break on social media for a few years at one point in my life. And then there's always that feeling of like, people are gonna forget about me, you know? Like, I'm gonna, all my subscribers are gonna leave, they're gonna abandon me, I can't let them down, or whatever. And I'm telling you, as someone who built a following like five years ago, and then went dark on social media for four years, and then I came back last year, and I was bigger and better than ever. Guys, so I just walked in, and setup is almost done. So here is our living room. Bunch of balloons, they're heart shaped. We have a love sign here that once it's dark, I'll plug it in so you can see. It says, I love you, balloons. And then here's all, I'm gonna do a fondue board later. So here's all the stuff. I'll show you guys that to after. Come to our bedroom. Some more candles. Look at how cute. I ordered this bear off of um, Amazon. He's so cute. All right guys, so I have some rose petals here and I'm just going to start sprinkling them throughout the place. chef should arrive in like two hours to start preparing for tonight.
up with these balloons but they're like attached they came down together all the other ones are still up and they're like attached so that's like dar and me oh so cute all right you guys so dar just called and he's on his way home i'm finishing my makeup since it is at our home um i'm just gonna be in my robe while he gets here and then um he has no clue that the house is decorated and then or that a chef is coming over she should be coming she should be getting here any minute now to start the cooking um so i'm gonna finish getting ready finish my makeup and then i am going to figure out something sexy to change into for tonight just kidding kind of okay so i'm putting this on so even if he tries to come in he will be stuck and i'll know for sure when he gets home so let me go ahead and lock both doors there you have it ladies and gentlemen i love looking at it decorated the sun's almost going to go down so i'm glad that he's going to get home right now to see it all in the daylight all right you guys i just heard the doorbell Chef Tracy just arrived and I thought it was dark. So I, I left her at the door. I ran to go get the camera <laughs> since I'm vlogging it. That's sorry. That's why I left you at the door because I thought it was dark. And I was like, oh no, I gotta get this on camera. So let me show you where you're setting up. Oh, this is dark. Beautiful. Thank you. How are you feeling? Really good. good. Yeah. Great. Thank you. Yeah. Um, you want to tell them what you're going to be making today? Yes. Um, I'm going to be making vegetarian Mexican food tonight. Yummy! It's our favorite. Some, yes. Some cheese enchiladas, some guacamole, some refried beans. Oh my gosh, some I'm, I'm so hungry already. <laughs> some veggie tortilla soup. Oh, yum. Really good. I cannot wait. So. Yay! So I'll be checking in with her throughout the night, you guys, so you guys could see um, how she's doing. <laughs> okay, guys. I hear the doorbell again. This has to be dark. False alarm the first time. And literally, I was still getting ready, so I'm in a row, but it's okay because I'm pregnant. I'm his gift. Just kidding. Oh my gosh, this looks amazing. Hey, I should have planned something like oh, <laughs> You always pl you always do the planning. Worse. Okay, come this oh, way. Oh my god. I thought we were just not doing anything for Valentine's Day this time. Let me take my shoes off one sec. Oh my god. Yeah, candles. You guys. Oh, you know what's really cool about these candles? Hold on. This is really cool, you guys. I haven't even showed it to you. Look, all the candles in the house are remote control. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Oh, what the heck? How did you do that? So you just go, look. Like this, look. Oh, I thought that was a real flame. Like, this is magic. What? It has a remote. How cool is that? I don't know. It's like magical. Like, whoa. Oh my God, babe, this is so sweet. Okay, come this Thank way. Thank you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Strippers, come out. <laughs> okay, I hear a noise. We have a guest. Oh my <laughs> God, hey, how's it hey, going? Hey, you remember hey, Chef you. Tracy? Wow. She oh is going goodness. to be cooking us dinner tonight. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, thank you so much. Sorry, I'm just like chicken I'm up so right now. I'm so excited for you guys. This is I awesome. I cannot believe Look, this. So Warren beat me to the money. I'm like, what can it. I surprise you with tomorrow? He surprised me with oh a baby. My God. <laughs> baby. Yeah, exactly. How, baby. Ella Rose. <laughs> how did you come up with all this? So cute. This is like more extravagant than people's weddings. <laughs> this is so Well, nice. since you're on the topic, just kidding. <laughs> Look at, isn't this cool? I'm obsessed with these. This is amazing. Off, on, flicker, is that what it's called? <laughs> and then follow me. This well, there's way. There's more to this? Do, do, do. Oh, so okay, wait, hit the set. remote. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. So cute. This is crazy. I can't believe you planned all this. The teddy this. bear is for Ella Rose. All right, you guys, look at how yummy this guacamole looks. Yum! And Dar is over here pouring some tequila. I got everything I need right here. Cheers. I got my tequila, I got chips and guac, I got my beautiful love of my life, and I got my baby right here. Yeah. This is everything I Ella need right is, here in life, guys. Ella, 
this meet your dad drinking tequila. <laughs> <laughs> I, I say to my rose, this is my this is my sexy Valentine's outfit. What do you think? I think you're sexy in everything. All right, our our UT is gonna be mad because you surprised me with all this and no, I haven't I think, done anything for you. I think they'll be really happy. Oh, uh, hello, you got me a freaking Rolex, like. Two oh, weeks yeah. ago. <laughs> this is seriously the best Valentine's Day ever. Aww. And we get to stay in, we're comfortable. What do we got here? So this is the vegetarian um, tortilla soup. Mm. Mm. Do you know I tried making enchiladas you did. on YouTube and, and it looks nothing Why? like that. Oh my God, I was you just saying. I just did it in five minutes. I'm like, no okay, way. is that what it's supposed to look like, babe? Cheese on them is that how so. mine looks or no? No. <laughs> So yeah, I, I don't know. It's so hard for me to actually like accept a surprise and have you do something nice for me because I keep thinking like I just want to do something nice for you. At the beginning of our relationship, it was on me who always surprised you. Dar's oh, no. first birthday <laughs> that we celebrated was actually a scavenger hunt. <laughs> do you oh, remember? Yeah. That was the very Laura's, first birthday she's and I celebrated. Pretty much taught me how to do sweet, thoughtful things. And he went all around downtown. No, Hollywood. I think just like growing up, like uh, we never really celebrated stuff, you know, like even like birthdays and Christmas and stuff like that. Like when I was a little kid. So Dar's family. Yeah, we're my talking family, about we my family. We celebrate like every little thing. <laughs> like, oh my gosh, your hair grew an inch. Let's yeah. have a party. <laughs> yeah, Tequila and Lotharia. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just it's like hard for me to actually have someone do something nice for me. Um, in this house we celebrate we're starting to celebrate everything which is really cool yeah and for you guys like I would just say it's changed my life so much just seeing how Laura like really celebrates things and makes them special so I don't know if like in your household you guys celebrate all these different occasions but I would just say like it makes life so much better and those memories are something that yeah even if you forever. guys just like get a cupcake and take a picture yeah. with it so you could always remember like this was the day that I did this you know and you look back and you're like oh that was a happy moment like I think it's so important because like yeah. not every day in life is gonna be like that or sometimes you struggle but then and when you look back and you're like, wow, I achieved this, I did this, like it's just the best feeling. So, I like how you said that. Yeah. Next up are these taquitos, and they're made with Yum. black beans and have some queso fresco on them. Here's some crema, and of course, you make it sound even better. It looks crema. good, but you make it sound even better. <laughs> and then, Darcy. you could double the price if Laura was selling these <laughs> just by how she describes it. And then, of course, Dar has to eat everything with his stuff. Yes. All right, so up next is this yummy vegetarian tortilla soup. I love tortilla soup, so I'm super excited about this. How do you feel? Everything so far has been a hit. The guacamole first was really, really good, and then these taquitos took it to like a whole new level, so. Now uh, it's now time it's like for the we soup. We got the soup, we got the beans, we got the rice, we got the enchiladas. Do we have dessert too? Wow. <laughs> And the tequila has kicked in, and ladies the and gentlemen. In. It's a good night. Alright, you guys, next up, I am putting together a little fondue board. So, there is more to this surprise. Yeah. Like, so I ordered these cute oh my little gosh. heart dishes on Amazon. They're so cute. It's actually a little fondue set. Um, so once the chocolate is melted, you light this candle, and then it keeps it warm like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I was not the type to slow down my life for you. Tight rope bounds with my ice cream. So I really love Rice Krispie Treats, you guys. So, um, I just bought these individual pockets and then I'm gonna go ahead and cut them into little squares so it's easier for dipping. I try one to make sure it doesn't mm -hmm. get you sick. Thanks, <laughs> All I did was buy these um, chocolate milk chocolate chips and I'm gonna go ahead and melt them. I'm going to cheat. I'm going to melt them in the microwave first and then I'm going to come put them on here and then it'll stay warm because all you got to do is light this candle under here 
And then you put this oh, here oh. and it keeps the chocolate warm. So, let me go ahead and warm up this chocolate. All right, guys, wish me luck. All right, you guys, so here is our little fondue board. We have bananas, Rice Krispie Treat, vanilla wafers, strawberry, brownies, and lemon cake, some blueberries. I'm gonna get some pretzels out because I love pretzels. And then here is the chocolate. What do you wanna try first? I'm gonna go for, yeah, I'll go with the banana. <laughs> And I think I'm gonna go with a Rice Krispie treat. Voila. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for everything. How lucky am I? But yeah, we're gonna finish eating dessert. And then Dora's gonna get dessert, dessert. We love you guys. And we will see you in the next one. Bye. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This banana is good. Yeah.